Hey, and welcome down by the Noodles Way. Anyway, hey, welcome back, you guys. And for those that are joining me, or us, honestly, for the first time, I don't know who us is, but me, <laughs> for the first time, um, welcome. Um, today, we're here to talk about my post-op. Well, this is the post-op video. It's been five days and I am okay. I have a little. Um, just to kind of let you all know, I'm still kind of achy. You know, I still have to take it easy, you know, um, especially with my toddlers. I can't really lift them. So, honestly, moms, listen, it doesn't matter what daddy says, don't listen to him. Um, hopefully he's there to support you, but if not, fuck him. And I'm telling you that because from somebody that knows, listen to your body, okay? All right, that was my disclosure. <clears throat> the only reason I'm saying that is because you're going to get a lot of phone calls and, you know, your significant other may not exactly understand because they're going to Google every little piece of thing um, Google only gives, you know, certain information per person. If you're not crazy, okay? You're not crazy. If you feel that you cannot do it, don't. Because right now you are still in the healing process. And I'm telling myself that because, again, I have someone that really doesn't really understand the whole thing. But, um, let's get into it. Again, I just wanted to give you that disclosure. Let you know that you're not crazy. Listen to your body. So again, today is the fifth day. I've had my surgery on Friday morning. If y'all, you know, got a chance to look at my um, last video, I know some of the things are kind of funny, but whatever. I'm just I have to give it to you straight, all right? Um, but. Like I said, I'm I'm still groggy, you know. I take my medicine as needed. I don't like taking it too much, but I'm be honest with you. Sometimes if I feel like I've done too much, then I'm gonna eat my medicine, you know, because the incisions still hurt. Um, I had got a laparoscopic or laparoscopic hysterectomy with a binary whatever, <laughs> meaning that. I got my ovary, well, I keep my ovaries, and I got my hysterectomy taken out of my stomach somehow through little incisions. I have five in total. Five in total. And they hurt like hell right now. I don't care what nobody says. I've had three, uh, I can't even think. I have, I had three C-sections, and I'm going to be honest with you, this still hurts. You know, I think it's mainly hurting from the inside, which feels so weird because it's not like I had an incision across my stomach. I've had several different incisions and they feel like I've been stabbed a few times. That's what they feel like. Um, so again, I mean, some of the things that I'm doing, I'm trying to walk around um, by the grace of my parents. They had a walker. I think for the first couple of days, I actually needed that because I just could not seem to walk on my own and it helped that way I didn't have to keep asking people oh, I need to go to the bathroom I can walk myself to the bathroom I have not yet went down the stairs yet kind of scared because it's like it's not the going down the stairs part is what scares me it's the coming back up you know um, this is the last week of school for my daughter um, and I'm kind of scared to kind of go down there. So you probably wonder, like, what am I eating? I'm having, like, food delivered to me and people bringing it and all that good stuff. I have people offer, you need any food? I'm like, I'm fine. I got, I got a salad. And, you know, I'm making do. You know, because I don't want to keep having to interrupt everybody else's daily schedule for me. So I'm trying to figure out how to move on my own. Um, so that's that. Uh, what else? Um, I'm gonna be very honest with you. I'm I'm a very open book. So 
you know, stay tuned for more videos because I know this one is pretty short, but if you all have any real questions about this, please hit me up because I'm straightforward and I'm gonna let you all the way in and I'm not gonna sugarcoat anything. You know, I know this morning I felt kind of sad because kids went to daycare. I'm like, I'm here by myself and, you know, but other than that, I mean, I'm okay. I'm just taking it one day at a time. Um, so again, if you have any questions, please definitely ask me because I'm gonna keep it straightforward with you. But again, if it seems like nobody else understands, I do. I understand, you know. Listen to your body. I don't care if they kept half the stuff. I don't care if you had a vaginal uh, hysterectomy, you know. I don't care if they chopped you up in pieces. The point is, you listen to your body. Don't worry about what nobody else says. Don't worry about what the Google says because everybody's different. Everybody is different. Everybody heals differently. Everybody's story is differently. So don't compare yourself. If, if, if you feel like you're just no pain at all and you can just hop, skip, and jump, wonderful. But I don't feel that way, okay? Um, but keep me posted. You know, let me know how you all feel about this. If you've had it, you know, post some of your comments and tell some of your testimonies. Let's help each other, you know, because there's somebody that's wondering, you know, about the post-op. Like, what happens to me afterwards? So let's, let's inform each other, okay? All right, I'm about to go, and I will see you all next week. Okay? Love you all. Thank you so much for joining me. But again, hit the bell because there's more videos to come. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like this video as well as any other videos that I've posted. Share my videos with other people because that's what I'm here for, to help inform moms or just anybody that may be going through this procedure or just anything that I've always that I've already talked about on my my channel but follow me all right moms thank you so much and enjoy the rest of your day love you bye, -bye. yo 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 it's week two and anyway, I hey it's week two and I am okay See, I got my hair back. I finally washed my hair and blew it out. I got so tired of that wig. <laughs> All right, but just to kind of give you all heads up, again, like I said, this is week two. Um, and I am walking, uh, going down the steps. I am cooking my own food now. I did have something delivered to me. I think it was a few days ago, but it was like so good. It was good. I found a vegan and vegetarian place. Super good. Um, I'm back on the health street, <laughs> as you can see from my, I think my earlier video when I was talking about that shake that I had. This is my good old Greek yogurt, 80 calories. But anyway, um. Yeah, I'm okay. Now, what I will tell you that the incisions that I did have, they were itching. Like, oh my gosh, it was crazy. It got to the point where, well, sometimes it still itches, but not as bad. But I'm no longer in pain, which means that I'm no longer taking my medication because I don't need it, you know, um, which is awesome. You know, so right now I'm just trying to, I'm still, like I said, I'm still in recovery because I think when it gets towards the end of the day, I kind of get like, oh gosh, because I'm dealing with the kids now. I still, I'm not really lifting them. I think every now and then I find myself doing that, but I should not be. Um, I have yet to be able to get them out the crib because that's going to be too much pulling on my abdomen area but other than that I'm fine so you'll be seeing week three soon I'm just trying to do these in week by week intervals so you can kind of know what's happening um, with me and my recovery but 
yeah the incisions will start to itch which is good um the liquid bandage came off on a lot of different areas i think the only part where it's still kind of hanging on is like probably like the lower part of me and then my belly button area which really feels weird because it feels like um you know when the baby first gets their belly button put it starts to get hard so it's still kind of hard a little bit right there but other than that um all right so stay tuned you guys thank you bye bye hey um welcome back um this is week three um so i'm gonna make this brief well brief <laughs> what f um honestly no pain at all and as you can see i'm in my workout gear i'm about to head to the gym get about 30 minutes of cardio um still not really lifting too much um i am able to, to lift my little one um elijah and sometimes Amari, but I can kind of feel it in my, my lower back. So I try not to lift them up too much. But other than that, yeah, um, I do like a light cardio, nothing too strenuous. Um, but so far, so good. We three, um, more physical. Um, and I actually have my post-op appointment coming up on Tuesday. And that is actually two days from now. So... I will be including that in this video to see how, you know, things went. Um, but other than that, week three is great. All right, you guys, keep, I'll keep you posted on how things go uh, with week four. But again, post-op appointment right after this. We're here for the post-op. Hello. Hello. So, so I am back home everything went well um, I still have my stitches so they have not fully dissolved yet um, but he said that that's a you know a lot of times when patients do come in that the stitches are still there sometimes so that's fine that's understandable but I should be good probably within he said two to four weeks he said um, I'll be able to presume all activity um, my incisions, you know, of course, are well. They're, they're okay. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I guess to kind of summarize what happened. So, yeah. That's good on my end. Alright, well, thank you guys. Um, so we'll be back for week four. I will see y'all later. I don't know why I keep doing this. Anyway. I'm just silly. All right, you guys, thank you. Bye-bye. Good morning, guys. It is that time again. I'm back to work. So, um, Well, I am headed to the daycare to drop these babies off and I am going to be heading to work. Hey guys, well I got to leave from here because I am about to walk into work. Alright, I will see you guys later. Hey, well I did my first day at work you guys. So I am going to leave you guys here. Um, I hope that you enjoyed um, this video. I hope it I hope it was very informative, um, educational and all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, please definitely leave comments because um, I love those because I respond to everyone. Um, also, like this channel, give me a big thumbs up, please, okay? Because it definitely helps out my channel. And honestly, don't forget to subscribe because there's always more to come. Who knows what's gonna be happening next week? <laughs> anyway, but you guys, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. And thank you for joining me. Alright, bye-bye loves.